Oh, how are you? Hey, hey, Jerry. That's a lot of wrestling in one day. Yeah, yeah, it is. But the reward is you get to you get to do a couple more tomorrow. How yeah. do you feel? Um, I mean, I'm feeling I'm feeling pretty good. You know, there was there's a good story about me coming back and you know making it as far as I did, and me and my brother, and I, I really uh, you know, I didn't do this for me. I did this for, for the support, the support group. You know, I've, it's been years and years of trials and tribulations and roadblocks and duties with the Marine Corps and everything in life. And so, you know, that was the whole thing going through my mind is, you know, being strategic and trying to just win. Yeah. I mean, that was a real battle there. Um, yeah. Very defensive. And, and how did you manage to, to, to get that, get that point and get the win? Uh you know, I knew that I knew that I was going to be able to get on top. Um, I, I had a feeling they were going to, they were going to put me down. Um, you know, that was just the real realism of it, I guess. Uh, but I had a lot of faith in, in our part there, our part there defense. We've worked strenuously at that. Uh, you know, I gave up a, a trap arm gut in the first and, uh, you know, my legs got tangled up against Vera. Uh, so it's not like me at all to give up points at all but when it when I did it was you know spur of the moment random things but uh once we got in in good position I was able to shut it down so and what are you thinking about tomorrow with uh with Joe what's your history with him and and what do you how do you attack that no um I don't have a history I think we're gonna go through I'm gonna um pick apart a couple of things I did good a couple of things that I did bad you know this is a new weight it's a bigger weight uh so I'm gonna take you know my strengths and and I'm going, I'm going to you know, explode and, and try to create them in the match. So I'm t- taking it one match at a time. I wasn't thinking about Joe, you know, during my match with Pat, I wasn't thinking about Pat during my match with Vera. So one match at a time, I take it to heart. So that's the plan. Yeah. Not a lot of the one seeds made it all the way through uh, to tomorrow. And you, you, you contributed to that. Did you see that happening? Have you paid attention to other matches and just said, you know what, if someone else can do that, I can. Um, I don't really pay attention and, and see somebody else do it. And, um, you know, think that I could, you know, I've got, we've got a team, an actual team that we train with, uh, you know, we're brothers and we, we fight day in, day out. And everyone that watches, you know, USA wrestling, they can tell uh, that the Marine Corps team is, is a different breed. And, you know, that's, that's how we've trained. That's how our, you know, the coaches, you know, created that culture and that environment. Um, I don't really, I like to think to myself that I'm, that I'm one of the leaders on the team. Um, I pride myself on that. And if anybody's going to do it, you know, like that, like the old Navy saying, you know, if not me, then who? So uh, that's, that's my mentality. Somebody's got to be a leader. I'd rather be the one to do it. Uh, check in here. I have one uh, media. Let's see if I have a question from Juan. Hey, John. Uh, first off, thank you for your service. Um, it's you, so Juan. awesome to see you and your brother, you know, in the same tournament. That's awesome. Um, my question to you is, how do we get Greco into mainstream? I mean, I, I'm a high school coach. I wrestled Greco, you know, when I was younger, and I love the sport. Um, but it's just so hard to get our youth into it. How, how do you think that we, that we do that as coaches? Well, I mean, I think the, I think, you know, first thing is, is getting, getting out there, you know, the Marine Corps does a lot of recruiting trips and once we do it, then, you know, I start getting hit back up, um, you know, on social media platforms or even my email or phone calls from the kids in the schools that I've ever met. Um, and they start asking me questions and the, you know, the fact of the matter is that we don't really train it. We don't really know. And, you know, everyone knows the saying, you, you don't know what you don't know. <laughs> um, and I think that plays a vital role. You know, I've had, you know, guys that are here at, at Olympic team trials that are in the finals right now. And they're asking me for critiques on, on gut wrenches and parterre defenses and, and how they can use it in the freestyle. And I think it is, it is a treasure that's unbeknownst to many. Um, you know, a, a lot of people don't, don't want to get into the Greco full time because it's hard on the body. It is, it's, it is exhausting. It's a brutal, violent matchup. And I truly think that if we start incorporating the things that we're doing here at the senior level and we get down into the grassroots, it's going to make a big difference. Absolutely. Well, uh, good luck to you tomorrow. And I Thank can't you. wait to see you in Tokyo, man. Thank you. Thank you. Great job. Thanks so much. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, Jerry.